Good afternoon. My name is Ms. Shailaja Khude and I am from Our Lady of Good Counsel High School, Sayan, Mumbai. Plastic, plastic here and there. Handling plastic, huge affair. Burning causes air pollution. Throwing makes land pollution. Plastic sold for consumer cash. Fills the ocean with full of trash. Millions of animals painfully die. After eating, that floats on by. Plastic, plastic, no more a burden. But it's treasure full of oil. So come on guys, let's catch from trash. Hooray, we found the solution. plastic oil field. Today, in this world of technology, plastic has become a part and parcel of human life. As we all know, that plastic does not get decomposed easily. In fact, it takes more than five generations to get disposed of. And hence, because of plastic, today our earth is at stake. And the only question arises, what action can we take? So our project is one of the best solution to this mountain problem of plastic waste disposal. A homemade oil refinery, that is, pyrolysis plant for waste plastic disposal. As we all, you will be shocked to know that India annually generates 5.6 million metric tons of plastic, and because of it, today our Earth is struck with the tsunami of plastic, where one metric ton is equal to 1,000 kg, and one kg of plastic can yield approximately one liter of fuel. So, by one metric ton, we can yield approximately 1,000 liter of fuel. And India annually generates 5.6 million metric tons. So just imagine how much oil we can generate through our project. So let's have a look at the youth working of our unique project Plus 2 Oil. Our project aims to solve the twin problem of environment pollution due to plastic and the need of an alternative fuel resource. This project is based on the principle of pyrolysis, that is, the thermal degradation of plastic in the absence of oxygen. Manjit, oxygen to anupasti, plastic to nikushtikar. There is a total conversion of waste plastic into value-added fuel products. The process consists of three steps, random depolymerization, condensation and fractional distillation. Here's a specially designed reactor in which plastic is fed and a catalyst, MgCO3, that is magnesium carbonate is added. We have already initiated the heating. Now, the plastic materials inside the reactor undergo the process of random depolymerization and get converted into three products that is coke, diesel, kerosene, LPG, etc. The pyrolytic gas gets evolved, which on cooling condenses into liquid fuel and gets collected in this chamber. This liquid fuel is also known as polyfuel, which is a mixture of diesel, petrol and kerosene with very high calorific value and can be used boilers, furnaces and stoves. This polyfuel can also be separated with the help of fractional distillation by difference in their boiling point. The sludge which is left in the reactor can be mixed with bitumen for the construction of road. As it is said that ideas without advantages are actually of no use. So here we have the advantages of our project. Cost effective and energy efficient. Our project is very cheap and affordable so people living in rural areas can easily implement this project. Eco-friendly, our project is pollution-free. That is, it does not cause any harm to the entire ecosystem. Plastic Waste Management By implementing this project, how to manage waste plastic would be no more a problem. Production of an alternative fuel source As we all know that we depend on Arab countries for the production of oil and other various minerals. So by implementing this project, we will be self-sufficient in oil production. By implementing this project, there is 80% of reduction in the emission of CO2 that is carbon dioxide, SO2 that is sulphur dioxide and other greenhouse gases emissions. It is quite shocking to know that it takes 200 million years to obtain oil naturally, but our new technique takes only 4 hours to obtain oil. There is tremendous amount of heat generated while heating this reactor. This heat can also be used to reheat the same reactor and also to run generators, which in turn will produce electricity. Future-oriented technology. If we successfully implement this technique, we will be on our way to an energy-independent nation. So plastic is no more a burden, isn't it? It's a treasure. 
So let's create an ideal recycling based society. Because now it's time to think globally, act locally. Think green, think clean. Care for the earth, care for the world. The earth is my home, I promise to keep it healthy and beautiful. I will love the land, the air, the water and all living creatures. I will be a defender of my planet, united with friends. I will save the earth. Swachh Sundar Bharat, yahi hamara khab. Thank you.